What is up, risk takers? Welcome to the Kill Pete Strategy. And welcome to another episode where I ask the question, will your country be the new risk meta settings? This is, will your country be the new meta settings? This is Italy. Progressive capitals. I'm in the third seat plays Magenta. This isn't really Italy, right? It's Italy and adjacent, but we'll go with it. If you if you hail from Greece, if you hail from south of France, Austria is included, all of the Balkans, essentially, there's a lot of countries here represented. I'm going to go with a no bonus pick. Yeah, I'm going to go with like one, two, three. This one has a bunch of cap cards. I like that one a lot. Adjacent to a five, we'll fort the five in and kind of watch and see who goes where. How you doing, Sam? Thomason says, a roast ribeye joint Yorkshire puddings roasty. Living the dream? Buddy, that does sound delicious. All right, so how many caps do we see in the open? We don't see the bot cap, which is blue. We actually only see whites, and whites in northern Italy. So we're going to have to kind of infer what the hell is going on. Settings are doing progressive capitals. Progressive capitals on Italy. Auto 6 with an expert automated. We start with one bot. Progressive cards. Balance blitz dice. Fog blitz are on. Portals lines are off. Looks like the bot stepped off cap. Bot is down there. Okay. Good to know. Can I snag a second cap? But Pete, this isn't my country. Yeah, I know. Lots of countries. Lots of countries. Why don't they have a Netherlands map? For real. Where's the why are the Netherlands being underrepresented in the annals of risk? Annals? Okay, we found the black cap. Good to know. The map would be sideways. <laughs> This is me playing Netherlands. The whole time, you just go like this. <laughs> it's not fully, not fully 50% is above sea level. My mother told me a great story yesterday that she says, I was at the Value Village, like the, the thrift store, and I was looking through a Dutch book, and I found a hundred guilder note. Godverdomme! I found a hundred guilder note and I said, Ma, hasn't it been like 25 years since fucking Netherlands switched over to the, uh, uh, to the Euro? And it's like, how much is a hundred guilders anyways? She's like $75, but dad tried to exchange it and they wouldn't give him any money. So we're going to have to go back to Holland. <laughs> All right, so black capped in a corner. Figure blues like Albania or something? I still have Deutschmarks, right on. Jocko says that SMG does not yet have the skill to capture the greatness of the kingdom of the Netherlands, yes. I believe. I believe as well, Jocko. How many years has it been since you guys switched over to the Euro? It's gotta be like 25 years or something now. 20, 20, 25, something like that? If you shackles from your trip to J Jerusalem, yeah, dude. I got a bunch of money from my travails as well. All right, looks like white wants a bonus next to black. Let's see if black lets him hold. 2002. Fair enough. You got any guilders? <laughs> I 
Okay, so my guess is the red cap is near there. And this is him putting troops on it. Maybe it's just red hitting shit. The music is chopping out. I'm here. Let me let me hit reset. I've heard this before, but I don't know how to fix it for you. It sounds fine to me. No, actually, now it's chopping for me too. One more time. Are you Maticus? Uncle Traveling Maddie? Still choppy or good? Still choppy? All right, too bad. Too bad. Okay, where do we think the red cap is then? It's a little exploratory. See, I want to go bottom right. But I don't know. Sounds fine to me. Yeah, it's it's, it's from di different people. Um, I can't figure out what the issue is, though. Definitely don't want to turn people off from listening to the stream. And because I can't solve the problem, and I can't field complaints, we'll just do no music. Sing for us? <laughs> Did white hold their bonus? Nobody's holding anything yet. Except for red. Okay, red holds plus three. So red's here. Yeah, red is here. Okay. Red has the bot cap? With some Chopin. I can't put on music if, it's gonna, if I'm going to get uh, people complaining about the choppiness and I can't fix the problem, so... I don't know what to tell you guys. One of you guys can put your fucking thinking caps on onto why, why it's crackly for some people and not others. Huh. The bot is strong. I love this. So the bot still has its capital plus Italy. Other people's connection might not work great. Who knows? I sincerely don't know. Okay. I'm enjoying watching everyone hit each other. I'm gonna break the second bonus of reds. That is a split bonus, so you guys know the, um, I'll show you the bonuses on the map. We got France, top left is four. Northern Italy plus five is three for five with that blizzard. Italian Peninsula plus six of four for six. Islands three for two. Ottoman Greece plus three. Adriatic Coast is split bonus plus three. And Austrian Empire, which I currently capped smack dab in the middle of, plus seven, if you can hold it.
All right. Red's still getting eight troops. Different causes could be quality audio setup on the receiving end. That's bad. They might not notice. Choppiness could be the way the music stream is added to the rest of the test. You can send some non copyrighted music through your mic. I'd like to stick the mic on the speaker. I, I don't understand. Okay. okay. Black has lost their capital. To red? To white. Black lost their capital to white. And they bought it. Yeah, shocker. Smell you later. Um, okay, 13 for the bot. <laughs> and plus a set. Mic on speaker because your voice that comes through the mic isn't affected. Right. Yeah. Meow says, I think to supplant your advance for meta, a map would have to be at least as big. Agree. Have plenty of bonuses. Agree. Have a layout that gets significantly impacted by blizzards. Agree. A lot of good capital choices and the best contenders have some issues. Correct. 100%. Solid analysis. This is why um, the quest for the next meta settings it's an uphill climb in the least. Also, how are you doing, Meow? It's good, man. Okay. I want to check, but let's see. Set early? Nah. See, I know that white... Was it white? Yeah, I think so. Ah, who fucking knows? I'm going to let these guys hit each other. Fight over the horses. Geography plays a role, too. Yeah, the fact that it's a geographic map rather than a fantasy uh, fictional risk map your spaceport videos have been really good thank you they're not doing all that great but i like them i'm really interested in figuring out you know how i can show you guys how i can you know make an interesting show for you guys um and you you guys can imagine that with a daily release it does become hard to come up with you know somewhat original ideas Simple world, fixed zombies with unstable portals, true random, five humans, it's the new meta. I'm down to flip coins with, with, with all y'all. I've just never been uh, a gambler historically, so. Yeah, Red is insisting on taking multiple bonuses. Man, watch that be the last black territory. No, white got broke too. So there's a bunch of black back there. Black doesn't have their capital. So maybe white didn't take it. Who got the black cap then? I am confused. Dude, also having 11 for this bot is great. Pete Love from Germany. Series and planning on grinding like last season negotiation. So once I figure out the next quote-unquote viable or something close to viable settings for ranked, I will do a ranked grind on them. Um, but the problem is, in order for me to do a ranked grind, I have to first first find the viable settings and then shoot a bunch of them in advance before I publish them. Um, so, even if I had something like that in the kitty, I wouldn't tell you, right? But I don't currently. Or do I? Um... Let's see. Manual setup to make the coin flip more frustrating. Dude, I would love to play the stupid uh, zombie roulette with manual. But I think what would happen is it would be very unfriendly to the newer players. So my zombie roulette on the stream is often like, um, hey, come hang out with me. Let's play, let's play a viewing game, right? And people would just get their fucking stack infected. <laughs> all the time and that might not be very fun for them so who knows right but is average advanced being considered as an option fits most of the criteria i think it's slightly too small it does you're you're right it does fit most of the criteria i think african advanced slightly too small personally Let's see maps by size 
a black ball. The Europe advances 83, Africa is 50. Yeah, they're like kind of different ballpark size wise. One up Pangea. Again, 65 territories. Few bonuses, not big. Similar problems. Okay, so it was purple that got the black cap. Okay. <laughs> All right. Where is red? And red is gotta be the type of guy who didn't put troops on his capital, right? Do I hit an 11? Okay, we do all right. We're not punished by that. Now watch, just just like last game, this guy also has fucking, uh, <laughs> watch, this guy also has a set. Set on three, right? No set, no set, no set. We're gonna put, we're gonna put red all the way down, <laughs> back to the Stone Age. What happened, Red? Were you going for bonuses? He quits immediately, right? There's a bot now? Yeah. <laughs> quits immediately. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Smell you later. Okay. 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 So, blue has now been broken. So, I'm guessing purple's on three caps? Yeah. Okay. I see that. Purple's on three caps. Um, I have the red kill. I think I take it. That helps. Thank you, bot. Thank you, bot. Yeah. So purple has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yeah. Purple is three caps plus this France bonus. Cool. I'm gonna get the red kill. Yay! All right, so now we're in a three-player game. Me, white, and purple. Do I give Purpy Boy the old huapa? No. He seems to be reasonably knowing what he's doing over there. My read on purple is that he seems to know what he's doing. So let's see. You did what the Romans did to the Corinthians. <laughs> the poor Corinthians. <laughs> yeah, there is one of those new Viking maps that, that looks pretty good. Is it Way to Valhalla? Is that the one? Or is it the one with the fun animals? That's hitting the blue. Okay, blue's now lo no longer there. That's good to know. So, okay, so I figure purple's cap is here. They have the neighbor cap of black, and then they have the bot cap, which is here, is my read on where the other caps are. But that's a guess. So we know, let's see, we know black, we know white, we know me, we know red. My guesses are that purple saw black, and then my other guess is that blue, blue bot is here, but purple now has it. I should figure, yeah, I should figure this out, though, before it gets, uh. Too much more spice. Okay. Yeah, let's see. Let's just map this board. 
Am I right? Okay. Okay. All right, so those are the three capitals, and purple did not put any troops on the back one. Oh! How you doing, Victor? What's up, Victor Slim? Okay, blue bot kill on the table. Three cards. Does white see it? Does white take it? Looks like white's trying. Does he miss the 11? No, white gets it. Okay, white gets the bot kill. Well played. Maybe not. Nope. White misses block kill. White just also wants to map. Got it. White's seeing what the hell's going on back there. So if the bot doesn't go to... Uh, if the bot doesn't set here, I have the kill. Set is 50. And I have cards. Sick. All right. White is just mapping the board. Good for you. Does Pearl have set on three and fuck this up? No set for... Ah! Ah! Okay. Okay. Okay, fine. So one big cap or what? Yeah, purple's just gonna card and pass, as am I. I think actually setting here too. Having three positions where I wanna be. All right. And now we're settling in, folks. All right, don't think we missed much. Perpy went to five cards. He played a 62 cap back there. Um, if he wants that cap back, he's going to have to bomb a bunch of troops. Early survivability from New Slam. <laughs> Important factor, indeed. Um... Burgesa says, what makes a map and settings a good candidate for being the meta? Is it a combination that heavily fav favors individual skill over luck? Yes. I mean, that's the, if you want a simple answer for what makes something meta, um, you would hope that the most skill-based, you would hope and assume that the thing that is the most skill-based becomes the meta. Um, in the sense that, 
players are going to do the thing that wins them games. I've I've learned this. This is a design principle uh, for games. Um, or I heard originally from Mark Ro- Rosewater that um, the lead designer of Magic the Gathering. He says that players are going to do what wins games, even if that thing isn't fun. So important to consider in game design. Oh, do I kill blue on three? I do, right? Let's get this bot off the table. Or do we want a bot in here? No, I think I kill the bot. Unless Perpy takes him. No, Perpy just hits me. That has to be worth it still. And I think white isn't very good, so. Sixty nine caps for the win. Ladies and gentlemen, do you believe in the power of 69 capitals? Because I do. Because I know I do. I don't even want to put those extra two troops on it. Okay. Now I think we're in a good way. Of course, the bot had another 7 3. I'm glad I killed it. <laughs> I'm glad I killed it. I want theirs to be. Okay, I should break my bonus like I give a fuck. Totally fine, White. Do your thing. I'm not trying to hold bonuses. I do not care about bonuses. Win, th win four v threes. Give me cap cards. I love this. <laughs> Argus says, were you serious about looking to set up? Yes. Offshore to save taxes? Yes, I am. You set up feelers? Thank you. Yeah, please. I am very interested, in fact. I just want to save money. You know, I want to run my business as smart as I can for my family. White has a whole buttload of off cap troops. Okay. 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 Yeah, purple discard and pass. I can discard and pass like We're fine here. We're in a leading position, but it doesn't matter. Like the outcome of this game will be um, someone suicides or bots, basically. Or gets card blocked. Maybe white gets, okay. Does white take the 57? Does white take the purple kill? That's actually possible. It won't set them. No, they steal a cap off me which just delays this game. Sure. Okay. Well played. <laughs> we're going to we're going to be here a while. <laughs> what do you mean when you say cap card? Sure. So, the capital I chose, this 71, um now has 100% of its cap cards available. So, my capital connects to 1 2 3 4 5 6 territories and all of those cap cards are available. So, what's a cap card? The way you win progressive capitals in the late game is by card blocking your opponent. So this cap, as I said, has one, two, three, four, five, six. This cap has one, two, three, four, five. This cap has one, two, three, but it's really only two because the 63 is a capital. So it's not an easy card to take. So one of the ways you lose right in the late game is you get card blocked. So obviously I don't want to be card blocked. Obviously, I don't want to lose this game. Um, so I do my best to take, to leave my caps as open as possible. Um, each card becomes worth a third of a set. Right now, each card is worth a third of 90, right? So each card's worth 30 troops, let's say. Which very quickly outshines any generation you're going to get 
um, from the bonuses on the map. So whereas white is trying to keep me off bonuses, they gave me a bunch of cap cards. So they're just actually helping me long term as long as I don't just get fucking teamed on, right? Which is possible, but unlikely in a three cap scenario. Um, dude, dude also has 109 off cap stacks. So purple is significantly, significantly better than white. Um, so my job right now is to not really antagonize. Just take my cheapest possible cards and chill. Yeah, and I still wanted to smack that 109 too because this guy's a dumbass for keeping all those troops off his cap. Um, I'm, I'm glad to watch your bit. Off to watch. Off to do my sponsor, Billy's. Thank you. Thank you, Miranda. Okay, so. How much did Buddy Boy here put in the pocket? 14 troops. Good to know. White is stacking on your cap like a bot. I know. <laughs> White's playing like a bot. <laughs> I, I saw him fortify it down there, yeah. Again, do not care, right? Happy to let this man fight for bonuses. Eventually, he sues into not me if I don't piss him off. He learned from them. <laughs> Maticus says, would you recommend someone who's never played or purchased Magic, the Gathering, to start collecting them in 2024? Yeah. Um, if you're um, if you're interested in playing, right, I, I don't see any point in collecting. Uh, look, you'd probably do better on the market, not necessarily, but you'd probably do better on the market than you would investing in Magic cards. Um, but if you're going to play them, um, I personally don't see any downside um, from buying a little bit and ideally allowing the um, increase in value to offset the expense that you outlay playing. Um, and Koshektik's point about you should watch Rudy from Alpha Investments. <laughs> He'll give you insight on that question. Rudy is hilarious. There are some really good nuggets of wisdom. Um, frankly, I could talk about investing in Magic the Gathering um, for a long time. Uh, <laughs> I could talk about the market. I'm a little bit out of date. That's the one thing. So I haven't been following the market closely. Um, and I'm sure, and it's, and it's changed in the past. It changed at a very uh, quick pace. And I assume that's probably accelerated from here. Okay. Do I want to spend my Joker? Yeah, I do want to spend my Joker. <laughs> I don't want to lose any of my capitals. Rudy's so funny. <laughs> Do you think that Fog War gives uh, a false sense of giving a player a better chance to win? F a Fog of War can allow a better player... Um, the chance to come back in the exact same scenario with fog on or fog off you can make like and i do you can make really really crazy risky plays that sometimes work because people don't expect them predict them or see them right and you guys see this from time to time in my games where you might be like pete that was a crazy play <laughs> and i and i'd be like yeah yeah it was but it worked, right? Can't get away with shit like that if everyone can see what you're doing. Hokaris, man, you fucking called it. This guy is totally playing like he's imitating the bot. I love it. How much is White getting? White getting bonus troops from what? Dude has a fucking third of his troops on his capital. <laughs> With white stacking so much off cap, it might be worth to check white's cap. I did, I did it immediately, Jocko. Might be an easy steal. No, I'm not trying to steal it because I don't want to provoke him to sue me. Um, 
but he already kind of is, right? He's stacking on me instead of Perpy, so. I was the, I was the head of your comment. Yeah. No, you, 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 I like, I like the level at which you see things. Very much so. Goes back to Kappa. Oh, purple. I would love it if you saw this asshole on me. <laughs> So I have like, no, me, we're, we're all about equal now. Purple and I have about the same troops. Okay. Wait, purple has more troops. Yeah, he's, he's ahead of me. Because he spent those cards. Oh, maybe purple goes for that white cap at some point. White's playing super dangerously with those off cap stacks, man. Yeah. <laughs> you see that shit? The fuck is he doing? <laughs> I love it. I love it. What the fuck is going on in Albania, man? <laughs> My opponents have so many off cap trips. Here I'd probably get 25 off the bottom cap, smack them into white, signaling to purple to attack them. Ooh, I would love to team on white with purple. I'm just getting the vibe that that's not what's happening. I think what's happening is these guys are going to start surrounding my capitals with stacks. Yeah, they're teaming on me. Except they don't know how because I have fucking three caps and a shitload of cap cards. Just kill them already. I'm trying. I'm trying parkour. I'm trying. For Map Master Mondays, can you play emergency calls only? Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do every single map. Why is your Venus stack so much bigger than the other stacks? Because it's my best capital. By one territory. One, two, three, four, five, six versus one, two, three, four, five. Wait a minute, open. Were you making a wiener joke? Was he making a Vienna joke or a wiener joke? Clearly it's time to do the thing or not. Hello, Pete and Chad. Thank you all for being awesome. You are also awesome, Phelan. We are including you in that one. The awesome people. You get drunk again? <laughs> nah. Coffee. I'm sure I will before too long. Mm -hmm.
Yeah, I feel like purple is not going to help me. Dumonic says, what's the weather like in Ontario today? It's fucking gorgeous in Virginia. It's a little cold. It's starting to get a little cold. We're at like 15 degrees, I think. I have 15. Yeah, 16 degrees. Oh, such odd play. There's almost no troops on his capital. Hmm. I mean, the idea to, to go for that cap steal starts to become more appealing. Ha! <laughs> it was all big purple went for it. Hmm. Ooh, little jokey joke. Venice Beach is pretty nice today. It's 10 a.m. I've been to the sand and seen some sexy bikinis already. Nice. Good good work, White! <laughs> Way to go! <laughs> oh, my God! Good work, White! <laughs> he paid two for one on that deal. <laughs> no, he paid more. 116 to 50. That's what I was hoping you'd do. <laughs> what the fuck plan is this? Okay. Purple puts themselves in a single position. Well, I'm definitely not losing any caps this way. I can't believe he fucking rolled into it. <laughs> I was having expected purple to kill white. I hope he does. <laughs> I hope he does. Do you know how long the longest game of Risk Online has taken? No. There was a, uh, a World Championship Finals that made it over 13 hours, though. Which, which, with which player do you think to end in the 1v1? I think I'm going heads up with purple. I think white is terrible. <laughs> and purple's okay. Purple actually hasn't done anything all that bad. Like, retreating to a single cap here, I don't hate. Um, he's, like, trying to instigate beef between me and uh, white. Which I can respect. What is a 24 hour game? Yeah. Mm. Dragonfire says, What's the long term strategy in the game? It always ends up waiting for the other to make a move. So, three player scenario, progressive capitals is very, very much, yeah. Wait for someone to suicide or bot or figure out if you can team with one guy on the other guy. Um, that's where the downside is of putting yourself in a single position as purple. You know, me being on three caps, I like a bit better than that. Carl. 
car do you drive? I have a Tesla. I was a pickup truck driver for my entire life, basically. The only vehicles I ever bought for myself were, were trucks because I ran a landscaping company. So I've been through like 10 pickup trucks. And once I finally was no longer in the labor business, I was like, okay, what, what car, if I'm going to buy a car, what car would I like to drive? And I was like, I'm, I'm very curious about the EV thing. I do see it's the way the sort of um, future is going, but I'm not trying to spend a bunch of money. Um, so the compromise I made was um, I bought myself a, or rather I financed, because I couldn't even afford to go out of pocket, I financed a nine-year-old Tesla Model S. So it would have been a top-of-the-line Tesla back in uh, 2015. Purple's trying to instigate with white now. And I love it. Having a, having a charger in your home, never have to go to a gas station, never have to buy gas. Um, I find the car very economical. I've had to fix a couple of things, but so far nothing major. Um, the sunroof broke. Uh, <laughs> the sunroof broke and they quoted me like $5,000 to repair it. And I was like, how much to close it and turn it into a roof? <laughs> and that was under 30. So... I lost the sunroof, but other than that, the uh, the auto steer is amazing, right? It stays in the lane. Um, it follows the car in front of you. I can really zone out in, in a great way um, in bumper to bumper traffic, right? I don't have to, I don't arrive. Toronto traffic is atrocious. So I don't have to drive tired or angry. I can just go in bumper to bumper. I can just click on the auto steer. It'll follow the car in front of me. I can be on my phone doing fucking YouTube comments. Same thing for long haul highway driving. I can go up, you know, drive 45 minutes to an hour, visit Kyle. I show up refreshed. I'm not tired. I'm not angry. Um, all of those things, I got to say, I love the love the Tesla Model S and probably looking to finance a newer one as my next choice. But I've also seen the Lucids. And if I start, you know, if I start feeling like, uh, like big money bags. Steals? Steals? No. Okay. Seals that one, because that one's better. Oh, purple, purple's chilling. Okay, purple's just smacking all the white. You guys seen those Lucids? They are beautiful cars. <laughs> um, your battery struggle with the cold. Well, last winter wasn't terribly cold. I think they don't charge as well. Also, it's an older car, so it's an older battery. You're still on the waitlist for a Cybertruck? Get the fuck out of here! You know, as soon as you say that, I'm like, yeah, that sounds like Kreskin, but, like, I wouldn't have ever... Okay. Are you getting it... Honest question. Are you getting it because you think it's cool? Or are you getting it because you think it's going to be, like, an excellent machine? Or both? Make sure you preheat the battery. Yeah, well, if you tell the car that it's, you're going to charge it, um, then it does start to... Precondition, it's called the battery. And I'm obviously going to be opening up your cap purple because you are causing some shit. I love it. Please continue to do so. Yo, Pete, I'm so sorry. So sorry to annoy you. But. Hundred million and one is divisible by 17 to get a whole number. You're not annoying me. Why would that annoy me? I don't care. I don't care remotely about that fact. <laughs> it doesn't annoy me at all. I feel no way about it. It's also probably incorrect. Very nice one to pick. Is this, is this another one of those memes that I don't know? Like the oil up meme. That's annoying for real. Is it? What is it? Clue me into the meme, guys. I'm <laughs> the kids. <laughs> I'm not with it. I'm not with it like the kids. In Japan, they sell more adult diapers than the baby ones. They do. Someone needs to clue me into the memes. It'll be pretty rad going 0 to 64.5 seconds in a freaking truck. Yeah, dude. Ooh. Oh! Oh no, my cap! No! Burpy boy! <laughs> Yo, 
I just, you know, I've been through my truck era, so. No, I don't want to be the guy who has to schlep his friend's stuff around. Hey, can you help me move? I have a curve in my spine. Please stop asking. Yeah, but can you help anyways? All right, fine. <laughs> like, I'm fucking 41, please. I don't want to be schlepping. No more schlepping. I've moved my sister, my one sister, so many fucking times. And by like the seventh or the eighth time, um, I finally got her. Um, this was my big ask. Uh, please close the boxes <laughs> so I can stack other shit. Fucking ridiculous. But she got her shit together. So here, borrow my truck. Yeah, for sure. Well, now that's where I'm at, right? Like, I'd still, you know what? I, if it was a good friend, I'd still help them move. But I'm old. I don't want to be fucking schlepping. Um, you know what I'm saying? I shouldn't be doing this. What's my prediction at this point in the game? Well, I mean, I'm going to play this game to win. I think my prediction is that white loses patience before purple. You're not too old. You're just out of shape. No, no, it's, it's both. <laughs> I, I am old and out of shape. I'm going to make these cap rolls if either of these guys want to take one. Very unappealing. It'll pretty much just sink Purple's game to take one of my caps. Which is what I want to have happen. Longest worst game I've ever played. Um, After about eight hours, my mind turns to mush. Eight, nine hours, something like that. I have no interest really in playing longer. I'm not really interested in looking at a screen for all, for like all those many hours. This is why when you guys see me stream, I, I tend to kind of kill it after about three hours. I need to stop, take a break, go outside, you know, relax. Not trying to live my life in front of a screen. Get off the legless. That's why the pyramids are the way they are. A shape that spans the test of time. We're talking about the pyramids? I don't like EVs, too heavy on the roads, not enough energy infrastructure in most areas. They require mining, many types of metal. That's not good for the earth. Yeah, I mean, I'm not, I'm not trying to save the earth. I'm not under any illusions that I could, even if I wanted to, which, you know, we can debate um, the ethics of the environmental movement um, till the cows come home. But what I am interested in is not being wasteful. And um, the cost of a 10-year-old Tesla one in which the minerals have already been mined. I'm switching from a pickup truck, which is, you know, fairly heavy on the fossil fuels. Um, I'm comfortable with my ethical calculus there, right? As far as not burning fossil fuels in a large internal combustion engine versus picking, a, picking up a used Tesla where the battery infrastructure. Um, also, fun fun bonus, um, the Tesla that I bought had grandfathered in um, free supercharging. So any supercharger I go to, I don't have to pay for the energy, which I fucking love. And that's, that's, how, that's how I see it making sense for me, right? It makes sense of financial sense. I'm spending, I think, about a fifth in terms of price performance for... Um, Right, between gasoline and, and electrical. I might be spending a bit more on the car itself. Free, yeah, free is the best price. They, they did that as some sort of a promotion um, when Teslas were new. Ha! <laughs> nice. With your free supercharging, do you have reduced speed of charging? I don't think so. 
I think the speed's a bit reduced because the uh, car itself is old. My father was still able to move big coaches, closets, and tables at the age of 62. Age is but a number. Man woke up early to his gymnastics. Fit as fizzle. Fiddle. Yeah. Hey, man. If I'll, I'll tell you, I've noticed a significant decline in my overall fitness since not having a labor job, right? Working outside was very good for my body net. Other than the, even, even considering I probably did put that curve into the spine. Um, don't mean to be controversial, but I actually do like being controversial. All right. Gandalf, you have the floor, sir. Um, fossil fuels aren't fossils, aren't running out, and burning them makes plant food. Tell me more. Recent studies show that CO2 levels are more tied with the ocean surface temperatures, which are linked by the sun, geothermal activity, and so on. Humans believe no input. Now I'm getting the popcorn. No, I don't think that's true, but I wouldn't be able to argue it scientifically. I don't think that uh, the environmental movement is a conspiracy. I think overly draconian restrictions because of the environmental logic could be conspiratorial. But I don't think we're just being lied to. <laughs> My favorite theory about why the Great Pyramids in Egypt were built is that they would work as industrial scale nitrogen factories for making fertilizer. How would that work? I thought they were made by aliens, man. Thanks, Market. Yeah, I appreciate the good luck. I'm sure we'll get there. You think we... Okay, I, I see what you're saying. You think we don't have a as big of an impact as uh, we are being told we have. Well, frankly, I have no way to know what's true or false there. If I don't trust the information that I'm presented with, then I have no way to figure it out. Hmm? So, purple car blocks actually kind of, kind of not that far off. Now he's in a single position, but white's not going to help me, right? White's, white's too shitty to car block purple. Interesting in making a new series from new to pro in risk. What do you mean? What type of series are you thinking? What would you want to see? Very interested in white and his off cap stacks, I gotta say. New account and a challenge in one year to top one in a season. I don't have the time to be number one. It's the problem. Um it would take me more hours of work than I have, right? It would it would take away from the show. I couldn't um I would have to play the same thing all the time, right? So unless the viewers on YouTube would want to see me um play the same thing all the time which they wouldn't I wouldn't be able to afford the time to be rank number one so it's a great idea for a show but it would also kill the show but to be fair you know 
I was ranked number two in the actual ranking system for our game um, for most of the year. And I'm still very interested in playing uh, in all the risk competitions I can. Maybe like a little bit less so now. I have to be somewhat selective. I've noticed a couple of events where games aren't being scheduled by the tournament organizer, and that's just so fucking annoying. What does purple have on his cap? Um, like a thousand troops? Slightly more, I'd say. Slightly more than a thousand troops. I mean, I can show you. Yeah, thousand one. Luke says, I'm 54, I own my own business, a distributorship. It's labor intensive, I'm sore and tired, but often in good shape. Uh, sore and tired, often, but in good shape. Staying away from foods that can cause inflammation and stretching regularly. Keys to prolonged good health. Flexibility, yes. You get sniped trying to grind to number one? Yeah, and that also true, right? I couldn't play any, uh, Kachetik's point is that um, if I tried to grind to number one, me, I couldn't play any of those games live. Right, because I would be sniped on them, which means the Twitch show wouldn't exist at all. And I, I basically have to spend 100% of my risk time on one setting, and I couldn't shoot it live. I would have to, and I couldn't really publish it on YouTube until it was all done. So I couldn't make the show, right? That's the issue with that. But other than that, yeah, I'd love to do it. <laughs> it just seems like the, the competitive scene is a lot more practical for me. Do you think a rank above Grandmaster should be added? No, I think the word Grandmaster should be used for far fewer people. So, but yes, we agree. <laughs> the word Grandmaster is used for not very good players. You think white was the one to crack, but now you think in purple? I don't know about that. I'm happy to watch them hit each other, though. That guy just lost 11 on a three. Grand Wizard, no, no, none of that. <laughs> I'm a Grand Wizard of, no, I no. No, no, no. Van Helsing, Van Helsing's Goose, hello. I've been empowered to unilaterate, unilaterally make a rule change risk, what's it's going to be? Um, I am, the rule change would be I am now running the entire game. Okay, we just split off 20 troops. Why? What are we trying to do? Don't know, don't care. I'm now in charge of the, the rule change I would make is I am now in charge of uh, the design of this game. 1K looks scary. Well, he just made it slightly less scary. What's up, Oss? Welcome, welcome. Captured defend with six dice instead of four. Oh man, it's three, but could you imagine if they defended with four? Oh. All right, Perpy. Let's go, Perpy boy. Pretty big off cap stack you have there, Perpy.
Okay, probably has a lot of off cap troops. I said six because it's a capital, and historically attacking fortresses requires like three times the defending force. Fortress, more like five tres. Mistress? Hot Pancakes says Purple's about to break. Oh, shit! Is there any chance you could break into white? <laughs> this man's gonna crack. He's reached his boiling point. No one has what it takes. Hey, we got Van Hel Helsing Goose sub. Thanks, brother. Thank you so much. Take care, Pete. Thank you for everything you do. Oh, cheers, man. Thank you for stopping by. Have a great Sunday. What's my plan for this game? Well, I have three of the six capitals. Uh, so my plan is for one of these guys to make a fatal mistake. Suicide. Bought out. And then beat the other one in the one one. Chat seems to be of the opinion that purple is close to cracking, but I don't think so. I think purple is significantly better than white. That's my read on the situation. Either way, I think I'm significantly better than both of them, and I'm going to win this game. Unless I run out of time. Right now we are an hour and eight minutes in. No, not a turning game. Just fun, ranked, progressive capitals. Purple don't crack. Hope not. I'm gonna get some lunch. <laughs> nice. You're out to commentate on Trem? Let's go! Let's go, Kraskin. Excited. He's tremming it. Someone cracks. Someone always cracks. Is this purple cracking? Is this purple cracking? 
All right, Pearl misses a card. Is that a bot out? All right, let's see if he stays botted. If he does, it's going to be bad for all those off cap stacks that White has. <laughs> Purple cracked. I knew it. <laughs> Well, let's see. Let's see if he actually bots out. <laughs> Tick tock, motherfucker. Come on, Maxi. Watch out, Pete. Summoning the devil. Yeah, that's why. He saw my 666 cap and he couldn't handle it. He was like, ah. Two cards behind. Are you doing VJ Caliber? Uh, I don't know if this has been discussed before, but a sandbox mode would be so fun. <laughs> yeah, it would. And it has. Yeah, it would, man. I wish. I wish those who made this game played it and loved it like we like we do. All right, finally bought out. Finally bought out. Those uh, those two hundred stacks are fucking in the line of fire. I wish it was a little bit taller. <laughs> I remember that song. Hit a two hundred stack. All right, now you got nowhere to go but into a two hundred stack. What? Ah. Oh! I wish I was a little bit taller. I wish I was a baller. I wish I had a girl. If I did, then I would call her. I wish I could steal this guy's cap like that. <laughs> Just did. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. All right. Four caps. Feels good. What's the game? Prog caps? Indeed. Indeed, indeed. All right, White. I'm going to take the continent southeast. So, progressive caps. We discussed this a bit earlier in the game. Um, oh, yeah, hit some, hit some perpy. Oh, yeah, hit some perpy. So each card in progressive capitals, right? Each card, the sets progress. So each card right now is worth a third of 250. So we are at, what, like 80-ish troops per card. The bonuses on this map are worth 4, 5, 6, 2, 7, 3, and 3, respectively. Holding bonuses in a situation where my opponents are card blocking me costs me those cards. So after a certain point in the game, which is map dependent, 
Um, progressive Capitals makes a lot more sense to not hold bonuses, but to make sure that your card options are numerous. So you don't want to card off. You don't want to lock out your capital. I hope White doesn't have any off cap troops because they're getting smacked. Uh huh. <laughs> there goes a hundred stack. <laughs> yeah, purple quit. White's well, gonna be an easy card block too because they're both they're on two adjacent capitals. Okay, oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's how you do it, my friend. Where's the last cap? There's last cap is here. White has two neighboring capitals. I feel like if white was smart, he'd just kill purple now and uh, and take second. So I'm obviously not going to lose this game. Right? <laughs> right? Remove white from the bottom. White can win. Pete sucks at this. Mean. No mean, Sam. Be nice. Be nice to me. Oh, yeah. Roll that fucking capital. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Love that. That was so expensive. <laughs> Great. Excellent. <laughs> GG White. Yeah. He's in big trouble. Yeah. Good game, buddy. Just came in for a Pete Masterclass 1v1 buy end game. Hope it's a master class. <laughs> Don't fuck it up. Is it Smackarino time? Not yet. It's not yet Smackarino time, but it's, it will be soon. The Renos will be smacked. Soon. Yes, soon. And watch out for purple, right? They're massive. Purple is Gigundo Enormo. But seeing as how it worked the first time, maybe that'll just co convince this guy to bot it. Oh, did he lose one of the capitals? <laughs> he lost one to the bot. Oh, I think he lost this one. I think he lost this one. So White's in these two, right? Because the bonus was broken. So for him to generate seven, he has uh, this capital and this capital, but not that capital. Otherwise, he would have held this bonus. The bot took the one in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. How do you slide so fast? Yeah, I have a wheel lock on my mouse. Yeah.
okay, this is okay. Don't have to do much yet. A new series planned on the channel. Yeah, I'm thinking about like this sort of idea, right? Will your country be the next risk meta settings? Um, and this map is called Italy, but it's like Italy and the adjacent. Yeah, it's called Italy, but it's, you know. Why wouldn't they just give us this, right? Cut out all the... I don't actually hate this map. You know what would be cool? I think Italy Advance would be cool. Right, this has the potential to have like the Adriatic, um, the Tyrrhenian Sea, the, um, you know, the French Riviera. This has a lot of potential if you to uh, to do it up something like, um, what's it called, like Europe Advanced. New series sniping other random streamers. Yeah, I get fucking banned pretty quick. Croatians? More like Croatians. <laughs> Wait, is, who, which one's Croatian? You think the latest Steam announcement of Risk? Tell me. Tell me, tell me. What do, what do we see? Am I adjacent Momoa lookalike? Oh, man. You could not possibly pay me a higher compliment, sir. You would love Italy Advance? Yeah, me too, man. 666 and 747. The airplane of hell. All right, the bot's really picking on him now. Is the spaceport map going to be the new meta? Nah, I don't think so. I like it a lot, but it's it's missing some key things. Spaceport is not, um, someone asked me earlier about trigons, right? Spaceport is not um, flexible enough f uh, for comebacks, which is another thing you really need for whatever the new meta might be. They wanted to let people choose a max stack size? Yeah, that's actually been in um that's been in risk for for a long time, right? You can have a as like some kind of pseudo stalemate prevention rule. Oh, did they just roll that cap? Holy fuck. No, they didn't, right? Oh, I should check. I should check. Check, 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 check it out. Do you have some troops on your cap? Oh, it's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> good game, buddy. <laughs> I believe it is you who will be tasting it. I bet he rolls again or quits. I hope he quits. No, he's hitting. He's smacking. I only need like 200 on the bottom cap. Any 
Maybe like leave 250. I like that top cap though. Does placement work different on caps? I think um, if if the cast victory happens, I think it ties both of those players and then it, it determines. Okay, he's going to roll it again. Please lose big. Lose big. Ooh, no, he gets a positive roll. Look at that, folks. We're going to be in this game a bit longer. Our friend here got a positive roll. He just abandons. He just abandons the cap. <laughs> I love you. I love you, White. I love you. Oh, my God. <laughs> White's asking to get third. Like, start hitting the bot, man. I'll give you second. <laughs> Step off. I don't know. Don't make me give you third. Ah, oh, man. I think that cab is empty. Yeah. Okay. That body out gets a higher placement is actually so strange. The word is not strange, sir. The word is a design flaw. Um, I took the South East Con and not such a bad idea. Yeah. I mean, I took it from white. So my job in doing that, when you saw me do it, I wasn't as interested in taking the bonus as I was from removing white from that position. I've now put white into a single place on this map. That is the only place where white is, which makes them easier to, to get card blocked. Um, now they're trading with the bot, basically. And that bot has a big stack there. So depending on what the bot does, You know, white might be kind of fucked. Yeah, now he's not punching through on that line. We're feeling good about this. Okay, I can punch through and take that cap now. Is he card blocked? Do you have cards, sir? Is it GG? Okay, he still has cards. Is there a strategy with training the bot to prevent that the cards get too expensive? Nah, you really have to like, well, I mean, if you can, you can lock the bot in a pocket um, such that it takes cards m over the course of multiple turns and then it sets less frequently. It, it really depends on the positioning in the, in the board. <laughs> Poor white man. White is just getting fucking pincered by this bot. Each car is now worth a th uh, full hundred troops. 
My longest win streak, I think, is uh, ranked is like 44 games. Um, and that was way back in the day. I was playing Free For All Progressive ranked um, top 1,000, top 100. Eventually got up to rank 29. Playing f fucking World Dom, if you can believe it. Um, wouldn't see that again. So, some asshole taught everyone how to win... Uh, <laughs> Win Prague World Dom on YouTube, and then they ruined the ruined it for everybody else. All right, sixty-two for a card. When a card's worth a hundred, give it to me for free. All right, not yet. Be so goaded. I'm all right. I've been playing a long time, right? So I've practiced. I'm not some sort of magical person, but I'm reasonably good at this game now. I would say. Bot hits them again. <laughs> he keeps putting troops in. Oh, I feel so terrible for this guy. <sighs> I feel so terrible for this guy. Poor dude. Thirty-two. All right, that's not as bad. What's the karaoke? I don't know, Marin. What do you want to hear? Is Purple Bot? Yeah. Yes, he is. That's what I wanted to see. I wanted to take that cap for free. All right, white has a final outpost in black's capital in the top left. White probably has... We wonder. Never mind. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> the bot killed him! Oh, no! Ladies and gentlemen... Uh Ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, that's a thing that happened. That's a thing that happened. I hope you all enjoyed this video. We don't force Trainer Joker because that would be dumb. We found some of this fun and entertaining. Maybe even a little bit educational and informative. If you're interested in getting better at the game of Risk, I invite you to subscribe to my channel and come along the ride with me. I have a daily release on YouTube. I do weekday streams on Twitch. I don't think Italy will be the new meta settings either. But that was a fun game. Hope you all enjoyed. After an hour and a half on the clock, we get the dubs. Defeating two novices and intermediate and an expert. Until next time, for all of you on the path to world domination, good games and good luck.